Congratulations, you found the only channel that will free your mind from the bonds of mental slavery forever. Today we go way back to the days before television, when pulp fiction novels stirred the imagination of Americans everywhere. Pulp magazines, also referred to as the pulps, were inexpensive fiction magazines that were published from 1896 to the late 1950s. They featured some of the wildest stories of crime, lust, and espionage. But what set these little works of literature apart was the incredible cover art done by some of the most talented artists of the time. Some of the coolest covers were done by Earl K. Burgey, an American artist and illustrator who painted cover art for thousands of pulp fiction magazines and paperback books. One of the most prolific pulp fiction artists of the 20th century, Burgey is recognized for creating, at the height of his career in 1948, the iconic cover of Anita Luce's Gentlemen Prefer Blondes, 1925, for Popular Library. At their peak of popularity in the 1920s-1940s the most successful pulps sold up to 1 million copies per issue. So kick back and relax and enjoy this trip back in the day when super cool cover art sparked the imagination of millions. I feel stolen moments is all that we share. You've got your family and they need you there. Though I try to resist being last on. for you 